During his four years at American, Brian Gilmore was a key member on two Patriot League championship winning teams in 2008 and 2009. We caught up with Brian this summer and learned more about his professional basketball career in Switzerland and currently in Poland. Brian is extremely competitive. And Brian was a guy that you, you knew he wasn't going to let up, and if he saw anybody else on the team letting up, he, he let them know. He was one of those guys who was very vocal. He challenged his, his teammates, and I think his teammates respected that because they knew that he was going to work as hard as he absolutely could every second he was out there on the court. Gilmore to the line to salt this one away, and it is all but there anyway. My junior year, it was a remarkable year. Winning that first title for AU and, and being part of that historic run that, that took us to the NCAA tournament for the first time was, was amazing. For me personally, it was my first time stepping into a bigger role as some of the seniors had left after my sophomore year. The band of guys we had that made that run really made it special because we stuck together. We were, we were like as tight-knit of a group as you can get. And when you're a part of a team like that, uh, there's really just nothing better. The Army game of semifinals of the Patriot League tournament my senior year, you know, that's definitely one of my favorite sports memories. I, I do remember it, I was forcing stuff in the first half. I got in foul trouble and Coach Jones kind of told me to settle down and to play. We were down, I think, 11 points and, and I scored 12 straight points in, in the second half to put us up. And then unfortunately got another foul and had to sit on the bench and watch and Army clawed back and got a four or five point lead. But Everyone on our team was really resilient. I mean, that's one of the great things about that senior class is we had five seniors starting. That made a big difference because we could always kind of look to the next guy and know, hey, it's all right, you know, we'll do the things we need to do to, to get this win. He finished his collegiate career with a great senior year, hitting probably, uh, certainly in, in my mind, the biggest shot in AU basketball history against Army in, in, in that uh, Patriot League tournament game. We had all, all the cylinders were rolling at the same time and, and it was looking very likely that we were going to repeat and go to the tournament for the second time in a row. After I finished my senior year, I knew I definitely wanted to continue to pursue uh, playing basketball professionally. I knew I could probably play overseas, specifically in, in Europe. And it actually wasn't until November that I got a job in Switzerland. My agent called me on the morning of my birthday, November 12th, and said, hey, we got you a job, you're going to Switzerland. The ability to continue playing because you were playing at a very good Division I level, I think it's something people have to understand that you can have a pro career with AU as kind of the foundation for you. And these guys have not just played over there, they've been big parts of the team over there. I went from Switzerland to Poland. My agent found me a job playing for a team in Poland, and the top league in Poland is is a really good league. I mean, it's one of the top 10 leagues in Europe for sure. They've got some ex-NBA players there and there's a lot of good good American guys, but also really good Polish players and, and other players in Europe. I did well, well enough to get a job. I'm, I signed to go back recently. I'm gonna go back and play for them again. That's exciting because the coach wants me to play a bigger role. He told me personally that he knew when he was building his team, he wanted me to be on his team for next year. And I think that's, that was a big compliment to me. But I do think that's one of the things that I can always bring a team is my fight, my desire to play as hard as I can no matter what. And so I'm really looking forward to playing for him, playing a bigger role and going back to Poland because it was a really good experience. I think it says something about AU. I think it says something about the quality of competition that you're going to get to play when you play basketball here and what that may mean for you down the road. Brian is, is talented, he's, he's extremely competitive and a terrific young man and way beyond basketball, you know, he was a great part of American University.